So how's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm gonna check out the new oil from, not new oil, but oil that's been out for a while and uh, the first time I'm gonna use this on the, uh, on my Honda CRV. So this is the Liquid Molly Special Tech AA oil. We're gonna check it out. We're gonna see if it's any better than the regular brand name synthetic oil. So guys, let's get started. So this is the Liquid Molly Special Tech AA SAE 020 oil. So uh, this is uh, made for Asian and American car. So Honda is also listed here. There you go, Honda. So you can use this on a Honda. So it's, it's, it's formulated for Asian and American car. So we'll see if we get any benefits from this oil and also I'm going to use the Bosch oil filter. It's a premium oil filter. And uh, first time also I'm going to use this one. I'm going to try it out if it's any good. If it does uh, good filtering instead of the uh, regular uh, original Honda oil filter. But first we're going to check out the benefits on this oil. So basically fuel economy is all the way up there. You got the full bar. And the reduction of friction and wear is about uh, I would say 90% according to their graph and the speed of oil penetration is also a hundred percent for the, the deposit and prevention is also 90 percent I would say and the oil film strength is about 75 percent so it's the first time that I'm gonna use this usually I use the uh, uh, Castro 0 W20 uh, for my cars so and then uh, we're gonna check it out so I already recorded the uh, fuel economy before the oil change and we'll see if we're going to get anything better from that. So the uh, CRV fuel consumption right now it's uh, 8.6 liter per 100 kilometer. So that's the uh, average fuel consumption of this uh, CRV. So when we change the oil uh, we're going to check it out if it's going to be better. So before I uh, put in the new oil on the CRV, the Liquid Molly uh, Special Tech AA oil, I just want to see, compare what the Castro looks like. So that's the Castro oil. So now I'm going to pour in the uh, Liquid Molly Special Tech oil. So they kind of look similar. Okay, so those, there's no difference on the look because the liquid moly mulligan is different. It looks green. So in this case, the uh, special tech, it's uh, it looks like a standard castor oil. So that's the castor oil. So this is the liquid moly special tech double A oil. And now we're gonna check out the because I still have lap over from the last uh, oil change on my BMW so this is the uh, Molygen oil as you can see it's totally different so this is the Molygen oil because it has a built-in additive and this is the special tech double A oil liquid moly and this is the castor oil so castor oil special tech oil looks similar but special tech oil against liquid moly as you can clearly see the difference so liquid moly is green in color the molygen because of the built-in uh, additive and this one special tech oil so it's always a good idea to warm up the car before you change the oil not too hot that you're going to burn yourself. Just warm it up for about 5 to 10 minutes. Just let it run for 5 to 10 minutes and that's it. So if the oil is warm, it will drain better. The drain plug is down there. It's uh, 17 millimeter. And uh, since the oil is warm, I can uh, drain it right now. So the oil plug is here. 
and that's a 17 millimeter so we have to do counterclockwise it's also gonna drain better if you remove the oil cap and also the dipstick just lift it up a bit so that's gonna make it drain better so now it's time to put back the drain plug so don't forget to install your new crush washer also So this you have to torque it down to 30 foot pounds. So you have to torque this down to 30 foot pounds. So this we're gonna go counterclockwise. So this is the uh, Bosch oil filter. I'm gonna put a little bit of oil on the gasket. Then we can install back onto the... So this one you just need to do hand tight. So the oil capacity on this uh, uh, Honda CRV 2016 it's 4.4 uh, liter with the oil filter included. So if you're not replacing the oil filter, it's only 4.2. So we're gonna put here 4.4 liter. So this is a 5 liter jug. I'm gonna measure with a dipstick. Okay, see? So that's good enough. Almost to the second marker. So that's good. So that's how you change the uh, oil on the 2016 Honda CRV. So to reset the oil light. So we're gonna go uh, click menu on the steering wheel and on the dash uh, we're gonna select vehicle information, maintenance info and we're gonna do a reset, we say yes. So that's how you reset the uh, oil life on your uh, 2016 Honda CRV. So this is the result after driving the car for one week. I didn't get any improvement on the gas mileage. It's still the same. 8.6 liter per 100 kilometer. So it's still the same mileage as the previous uh, reading. So you know what? The only difference that I can feel on the car is it's a bit smoother, maybe because it's a new oil, but that's about it. So I don't see any benefits on getting a better gas mileage on this oil. Like a drug that I just can't deny giving me the best.